Hi, we're still on um, Alex Cute here, and this is real metal. And yes, you can see through this terminal. So if we're talking about transparency, shading, opacity, and um, fading away, fading in and out, those are typical things that are done with a compositor is a name. And one of them is Pycom. Well, it used to be, yes, Compton. So when you type in, and that's Arch Linux for you, nothing to do with us guys. And if you type in Compton, you actually are going to install PyCam, which I've already done. And when you boot up Arch Linux B, 20.4.10, uh, uh, that's it, uh, you'll see it's not there and it's going to be on the ISO next time around. So just install it. And uh, the packages have been updated because PyCam is the new name. Compton was the old. At this point in time, everything still is gonna work with Compton.conf and so on. But you know, uh, at some point in time, you really need to switch. And that's just what I've done a few uh, minutes ago. So we've done an update. And of course the update has been applied already. You see the transparency and it's gonna be in the ETC scale. So you type scale and then everything is in there. So what did we do? We can always look back what changed first of all get your application it's like the same thing if you want to have plank so you go pack my minus s plank plank is the uh, application and the arch linux plank themes are the themes right so the same applies here we've just shown you how to install pycom now where is it installed for first of all in lxqt we are going to tell him where to boot up so we have a auto start telling pycom hey Come on, be there, run, right? And inside is a technical text that says, look, go and have a look, whoops, go and have a look at this particular um, pathway. There you'll find a configuration for LXQ because we, when you have this possibility with Control alt e and you go to the tweet tool, every, uh, there we are, every uh, desktop we have, not every, but all the tiling window managers and up on box, for instance, they're using Compton. So we need to apply a different Compton for each, and then we can have some teams and tweaks and, and change things around in those specific desktops. So each of them has their own pycom.conf. So config LXQT, all right, we go one up, we go to LXQ, and in here is a pycon.com. So if you have here a compton.com, well, that's good, but it will never ever be used. So you can, you can clean it out. Even if it also was in the auto start, you can clean it out here as well. It's the one, the new name, we're gonna use that one, right? And not compton. So clean it out as I have done already. So if you relaunch, pycon is installed, all the, the, the data is here, all the settings are here, then everything is gonna work out of the box and you'll have Transparency, Control T. Well, other screen, of course, why not? So this one is now here. Which is this one? This is Q terminal, right? Uh, let's do Super T, that's one I know as well. Super T, sorry. So U R U R X V T, and it's transparent as well, as you can see. Let's do um, Termite. Let's, yeah, you can either type it here, but there is super shift D, which is in our fingers always, and we can launch Thermite that way as well. So as you see, transparency is working and um, those settings are now being applied. All right, that's Compton for you. No, that's Pycom for you. Cheers.